Welcome back, my bestest buddy. I hope for some of you it's back from a three-day weekend, right? We had that MLK weekend. So hope you enjoyed yourself and you're all ready to get back to work. We are here with some new tools from Harbor Freight. It's been a while since we did one of these. So let's look in on the old Harbor Freight, you old Harbor Freight, and see what they have out here. The uh, Vulcan came out with a TIG, uh, uh, their TIG torch, uh, their stubby, stubby lens kit. So that's that's new. We haven't seen anything from Vulcan for a while, have we? Anyway, Chief is coming out with a lot of new stuff, including these uh, two-inch double double cut uh, solid carbide burrs of different flavors. So that's kind of new. Not going to speak to those. Don't really use that tool a whole lot. For you icon, icon, icon fans out there. The Toolbox Lock Set, six pack, 20 bucks. Anyway, moving along, the Titanium 150 amps, 150H spool gun. Now, Redemption Garage, Brian over there, I hope you guys know him. Brian was talking about this when he picked up his, his uh, Titanium welder and said, wow, you know, he, he was going to have to go shopping for the, one of those. That's what he was looking for. And I think he even mentioned that he thought Harbor Freight would be coming out with one. And boom, here it was. Oh, we could see the future. Maybe he'll start reading palms online. So anyway, it fits the, uh, what was it? The 140, the 170, and the Ultimate 200 Titanium MIG welder. So there you guys go. Spool gun from Titanium. Uh Drum and quarter horsepower, submersible pump. What are you going to say? It's a submersible pump. Diablo, I'm not sure what's going on with these. Did they switch the bland, brand or whatever? I remember there was, they were clearancing a bunch of these, and so these must be the replacements, I'm guessing. Anyway, moving along, any, you know, $99 for 50 foot, and $2 a foot, I don't know. U.S. General has this screwdriver rack. Now, if you guys saw my videos on this, you know I wasn't too impressed by the wrench rack because it didn't work too good on my gear wrench, uh, ratcheting wrenches. You know, I had to uh, have the swivel head, pivot head, and ratcheting wrenches, and it doesn't work with a crap on those. Uh, I'm guessing these have the magnetic base as well, screwdriver rack. So, you know, $8.99 and all these prices are probably going to adjust a little bit once the, you know, marketing people figure out a sweet spot for sales on these. But even at $8.99, if we have that favorite of mine anyway, five items or sometimes more, for under ten dollars 30 percent off coupon which i think is coming up this one's going to qualify for it so at you know under seven bucks might be just worth having a look what is that going to be about six, probably closer to six right so it'll be worth having a look here it is chief is coming out with new stuff so i think polar jason shout out to to jason there um has this cheap professional long barrel air hammer and i think um, even Justin Dow recently had to replace his. Now, Jason got a, um, uh, uh, replaced his snap-on with another snap-on. And, and I believe that Justin went with, was it a Matco or a Mac? I can't remember. But he, um, he it was something that he's been looking out for a while. And here is Chief, you know, are they going to step up their game? Maybe, you know, I mean, a hundred bucks and a, you know this I, I can't remember if cheap is one of those that that is excluded by the 20 percent off coupon but I'll certainly mention that in the captions below here along with all the part numbers and stuff for this stuff that i'm not going directly into and looking at but it might just be something to look at and along with the new long barrel uh, hammer they got the uh chisel set for an additional 35 bucks so you know there's that right so if i don't know i think that if you've moved away from chief because of the quality that you were worried about then i think now is the time to maybe check them out again i know you know i don't know if this is something i want to invest in but gosh you know i want to try it <laughs> just so i can let you guys know if it if 
if it works well. If these are things that you guys are looking into, please share your thoughts down below in the links and, and information, you know, below that in the comments. Now, remember Bauer came out with that corded random orbital six and what is it, six inch uh, polisher, and they they had the the coarse and the medium buffer wheels or polisher pads for it. And now here we've seen the fine and the ultra fine in the next one here. So now that orbital polisher from Bauer is going to have all a full line of the polisher pads for it. So that's kind of cool. The uh, Pittsburgh Automotive, $89.99, that's probably going to come down. You know, I think that's going to come down quite a bit. And then, you know, let's not forget, we got those coupons. And then I'm going to skip over and look at the Icon. We've seen Icon has come out with quite a few of these smaller sets now. Um, in, in this case, the half inch drive uh, bit socket set. And they had several other ones as well as crow feet and some, some other deep sockets. But I wanted to mention this about Icon, 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 just so I know, I know everybody else talks about it, so I'm not going to get too much into it. But I did want to mention that it will be interesting to see how these bits from Icon, their upper echelon manufacturer, hold up, because I don't know if anybody else has picked up on this, but it seems like whenever I go and look at the um, the little clearance section, it seems like there's always a lot of the Pittsburgh uh, automotive or Pittsburgh professional, whatever they are, of, of these type of, of driver bit sets in there, which I'm thinking is because they've had to pull one or two of them off to replace others under their lifetime warranty that broke. So, you always see those there, so I'm curious to see how these hold up. If you have any experience with the ones that have already come out, please let everybody know in the comments below. Now, here's what I was excited about, and I'm, I wanted to actually stop in on, was this Voyage, Voyager 18-inch heavy-duty impact-resistant toolbox, and I am hoping they're going to come down on this $89 price, or, I'm sorry, $39.99 price, it's a $40 price, to... Who knows, maybe even, you know, what do you think, guys? Could, could we get it for $29.99, 30 bucks? But it's not an excluded item from the 20% off coupon. So there's that. So that's already down at about just over 30 bucks, right? But I wanted to stop in here and show you this case. This is kind of cool. It it would be perfect for what they're showing it here to put your electrical stuff in. It looks like it's going to have some level of dust and water resistance to it. Let me know what you guys think. Check out the links and information below. Now, I appreciate you all coming out and spending a little bit of time with me and checking out the new stuff from Harbor Freight. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and share my videos. And if you get a moment, click on that notification bell down in the corner so that you can get something in your inbox when I have new content available. Now, if you are coming up on your weekend, I hope you all make it a good one. Now, take care.